What's up, YouTube? This is Slide8Fry here. I'm really pleased to see that one of my most recent React videos to the uh, Sassy Justice that was partially worked on by the South Park creators Trey Parker and Matt Stone is crushing it compared to my other React videos. It hasn't gotten the most views out of my Reacts yet, but I'm completely confident, confident it's going to. First, the most views went to the Ricky Gervais React, which, ha which ha has around 900 right now. Um, next, it was to the Woke Utopia Jonathan Pye React, uh, which surpassed it and is well over 1,000. And then a video that came out several months before the Woke Utopia one uh, came from behind, apparently, and then uh, surpassed the Jonathan Pye one and is now in the lead. It's the my first Scott the Waz React video where he was reviewing anime games. Um, but this, but the one to Sassy Justice, it already has a thousand views in just two days, which I know that's low, but for my standards, that's pretty good, and I'm really happy about that. So after you're done with this, come back and go watch that video, increase the momentum, keep it going. I, I would like to see a React video get to 2,000 views if, po if possible, but I don't want to raise my hopes, hopes up too high. Um, anyways, I recently voted on October 27th. I voted yes on Prop 22 because I want to make sure us DoorDash drivers, Uber drivers, whatever the case may be, remain independent contractors in the state of California. Now, if you're not from California, this doesn't matter to you. But uh, if you're from California, please vote yes on Prop 22. We need this proposition to pass because if it fails, we'll be forced to be employees, which, look, I'm not saying being an employee is a bad thing. Most jobs, that's how it should be. It, because it has to be a consistent flow for the for a big for a company in a store or restaurant whatever but this is an independent job where we're just driving our car and doing stuff and, and getting paid to do what we do if we're employees it's a huge in inconvenience most people who do uber or doordash do it as a second job for extra income some people do it full time but the ones who do it full time do it at the convenience of their own schedule and work whatever hours they want and if there's an emergency or something going on they have the freedom to turn off the app leave uh, finish uh, stop work and take care of the emergency or whatever situation that may be if I'm forced to be an employee it's gonna be a lot harder for me to take my wife to work and back as I'm the one who drives between us not her um, anyways let's get to the video it's actually a really short one a Ryan George react I haven't actually done a react to Ryan George in quite some time but I just felt like doing one just cuz uh, I was in the mood to do some reacts today anyways and his videos are short and really easy to make reacts for. So let's do this. Hey, okay, listen, I'm going to need you to put this cone-shaped hat on, okay? Is this like a dunce cap, like for dumb kids? <laughs> kind of, yeah, today's the big day. What are you talking, what day is it? 10,950 days ago, you came out of your mom's, you know, her parts. Oh, oh my God. Right out of there, 30 years ago, to the day. Okay, that's kind of a weird <laughs> thing to bring up, man. She pushed so hard, dude, she never felt pain like that before. Childbirth is quite literally trauma. <laughs> Why are you, I don't want to talk about this. <laughs> well, I thought we could celebrate the day, you know, mark the occasion. Another year has passed since that happened. Ugh, like, I mean, I guess I could give her a call. No, 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 no. I thought we could celebrate you. Oh, well, you know, she did all the work that day. I mean, all <laughs> That's I did true. was scream and poop That's black. <laughs> yeah, we'll figure out a day to celebrate all mothers at work. Just kind of get that out of the way. Today's mother's Day isn't okay, invented so yet. What okay. What do you want to do exactly? Well, first of all, I got a cake. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I mean, I guess that's nice. Yeah. So here that is. What are all those things sticking out of it? Oh, these are, just, these are to hold the fire. <laughs> the fire? What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm gonna set these little things on fire. Why? No, please don't do that. There's one here for every year that's passed since you traumatize your mom and poop black and scream. <laughs> you don't need to get fire involved. That's not gonna change the number of things you put in the cake. Well, we're gonna get fire involved, I decided. Okay. So just, here we go. The cake's on fire now. Ooh. Super dangerous. And that's just gonna go right under your face for the parts coming up, okay? Sound good? Okay, I don't like this situation at all. Okay, so I wrote a song that you're gonna have to listen to now. Okay, is it long? Not really, no, but it's gonna feel long for sure. Uh, happy birthday to you. <clears throat> okay. Happy birthday to you. You already said that part. Happy birthday. <laughs> 
birthday, dear Jeremiah. That did not flow well. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Okay, there's that line again. Okay, so that's all done now. That was that was the song. I didn't I didn't know what to do with myself that entire time. You did great. That was a great moment. I have no regrets. If I could be honest and critical about it, I feel like no effort was put into those lyrics. <laughs> yeah, I didn't spend a ton of time on it. Yeah, you that's said the true. same line three times. You shoved my name in the third line. It didn't even fit there. Yeah, it would have worked better if your name was two syllables. Okay, time to make a wish. Yeah, true. Now. Make a wish. What are you talking about? You gotta make a wish now. I decided it's time for some magic. What? Just, you know, wish for whatever you want to happen in the next 365 days. But, okay, I guess I want, uh... No, don't tell me. What? Why? Well, if you tell me, it's not gonna come true. What are you talking... Why would that be part of it? <laughs> Look, I don't make the rules when it comes to magic. Just make a wish in your head and don't tell anyone. Okay, uh... All right. Did you do it? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I don't have any way to verify that, so I'm gonna trust you. Now we gotta deal with this fire. <laughs> yeah, I agree. All right, so, you know, you gotta deal with this now. This is your responsibility, I decided. Why did you set this on fire if you had no intention of dealing with the aftermath? Put it out. Stop the flames. All right, I mean, I think I have an extinguisher in the other room. <laughs> oh, use God, your that mouth. would... You have to use your mouth. I'm not... <laughs> Imagine using a fire extinguisher to put out a birthday cake. That would be horrible. It'd be a bunch of foam and shit. Shit on the cake! Oh God! <laughs> Putting my mouth on this. Don't use the air from your mouth. No, blow really hard, like <laughs> like weaponize your breath. Uh, okay. Yeah, try to get them all at once. It's an accomplishment if you do them all at once. I decided. Okay, I mean it's done. The the baked good is no longer incendiary. Yeah, all right, great. Now <laughs> cut that up and give me as much as I ask for. I thought this was for you. Kind of implied this was for me. No, it is for you. But also you got to give me as much as I ask for. You know that's just polite. It sounds like you got yourself a cake. It'd also be polite if you offer some for me to bring home in case there's any left. Okay, you know what? I feel really weird about this whole thing. You got mm -hmm. me celebrating a day I had almost nothing to do with. You have all these ritual things you want to do. Which yeah. Yeah. Do every year for everybody's day of birth. Every oh. year. So yeah, I don't know if I want to be every a part of this. It just feels completely unnecessary. Oh, I almost forgot. You get presents too. Well, I do deserve a little something. It is my birthday. <laughs> that changes everything. <laughs> oh, I love me some Ryan George. He really, truly is a comedic genius. And, um,. I think I just saw he has over 600,000 subscribers. I, I, I could have sworn last I checked he had like 300,000 or something. But um, he's doing really well for himself. Uh, obviously, he's still, I think, most well known for um, Screen Rant's uh, Pitch Meeting, which is a channel that has like, was it 6 million subscribers, I think. Um, but Ryan George's own videos on his own channel, they're just hilarious. He truly is a comedic genius. He's one of my favorites to watch. And... Honestly, I actually have to thank Screen Rant for pitch meeting because I actually didn't know this guy about this guy prior. Although ironically, there was a video of his I watched way back in like 2008 or something. That was new at the time where he was doing the Saxman song and had, you know, a superimposed mouth on Jack Black doing the singing. And I didn't realize that was uh, Ryan George's channel until that video actually was suggested to me like I don't know like the beginning of the year or last year or whatever um, I've been subscribed to Ryan George for more than a year now I think um, but yeah well, that was quite a blast think about it like if you were to introduce birth like if birthdays never existed and you introduce them for the first time right now without people are so cautious about things like fire and all that stuff I probably would go like that. It probably wouldn't go over all too well, especially if you're going to say, like, oh, well, give your guests more ca more slices of cake or as much as they want. Like, I thought it was my day. What? You know? Um, I love it. Once again, fine work, Ryan George. You, you truly are amazing. Um, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And click that bell, contact me notifications. And uh, check out my other React videos. I actually have a playlist of Ryan George Reacts. It, uh, it's not all of them. I'd have uh, like 20 videos in there if it was all of the ones that, have, that uh, I have watched from this year when I started doing React videos for the first time. Um, but uh, yeah, it has, it, it, it's, uh, I believe it's called, I believe the playlist is called Ryan George and Pitch Meetings or 
maybe pitch meetings and Ryan George. I don't remember, but it has some other Ryan George original videos that I'm reacting to. It has some pitch meetings I'm reacting to. Lots of fun stuff. And plus, I actually also have that 10 second clip where uh, they do a pitch meeting and pitch and they pitch no movie. And actually, yeah, I came up with that back in March, I think. And then eventually, for the 200th video of of pitch meeting, they finally came up with uh, their own version of it. I had to edit some clips together from different pitch meetings to make it fluent, but um, it, which is obvious because they're wearing different shirts and stuff. But um, it's cool to see that they actually did one of their own that, uh, you know, is just one video. <laughs> but, <laughs> but anyways, um, that will conclude this React video. Thank you so much for watching.